I think we are at the very beginning of a very important, very interesting debate about the uh, energy prices in Europe because uh, it appeared that energy prices uh, in Europe is the most important factor for our competitiveness, in fact for losing our competitiveness. That's why the European Council decided to put this question into the, the debate. I'm, I'm, I haven't a feeling that we found a solution but uh, we, we surely opened the, the question and uh, we are the, at the beginning of, the, of, this, of this debate and that's why we, we invited the sector, the energy sector from Central Europe to share their opinion about the implementation of, of uh, energy policy we have and uh, about the implementation of the climate policy we have and what could be done for future uh, to find better, more uh, cost-effective solutions, because Europe, not only Central Europe, but the whole Europe, needs much, uh, uh, much cheaper energy, and some aspects of the European policies in uh, energy and climate areas are responsible for, for higher prices. That's why we should uh, um, continue this debate and, and we should revise some of our uh, policies to make uh, industry and, and business life in Europe easier. The European energy policy uh, is uh, creating handicaps uh, for certain industrial sectors uh, and also for certain countries and in my view it is not by chance uh, that the countries who have disadvantages are the new member states. I feel it's very important uh, that the new member states understand uh, that uh, they have common interests because they are still in a process of economic transformation and economic catching up. They have common interests uh, and they should defend them together.